Hey guys, it's Adam here, your Northern Tech, and today we're going to do a little video of a little, little bit of a tutorial here. Uh, first off, we're going to start off with Magic's Movie Edit Pro. As you can tell, I'm using version 2013. It's uh, not the latest, 2014 just came out, but it'll do the job. Basically, I was asked in the past. Now, I'm going to show you, I'm going to drag a uh, video clip in, and you're going to notice, oh, what's this? Oh, shit. One second. I just, just, just installed this the other night so I could use it for uh, video editing. So we'll probably cut that out. And as you can tell here, my audio and video are in one stream. If you right click on it, you go to audio display, you can actually go create waveform, which you can see there's the waveform. I don't like it like that. I like my video on one track, audio on the other. And there's a reason for that is because sometimes I don't want the audio in it. Sure, I can just grab the slider here and go bam. Now there's no audio, but it also gets rid of the video. Okay, no, it doesn't. It just gets rid of the audio. But that's no good for me for what I want to do. I like to have the audio on one track, video on another in case I want to dub in some audio or, or whatnot. Easy fix for that is when it's like this, if you right click on it and you go to audio waveform data, you can click right here, video audio on separate tracks, bam. Now let's say you want it to stay like this permanently. You no longer want to ever have it put a audio track and video track in one track. All you do is come up here to settings. Once that opens under video audio right here under the arranger video audio on one track, just uncheck mark that click. Okay. And now if we drag in another video, it'll automatically put it on two tracks. And you right click, you go to, uh, freak sakes, where is it? Uh, create waveform, sorry. There we go. And then it'll quickly create the waveform for the track. So hopefully that quick little setting answers the questions for people that were asking about this. It's one of the pet peeves that I have ever since they released MX. They've been doing it where the audio and the video have been in one track and it's been driving me completely bonkers. So hopefully that solves uh, a lot of problems for a lot of you out there. And uh, if you have any questions, comments, leave them in the comments section below and uh, stay tuned for more video editing tutorials and how to use your software. All right, guys, until next time, peace the frig out.